episode 17 of March Motivation Madness. Welcome back to the Fit Pro Podcast. I'm your host, Marvin Fayez, and today's episode is episode 93 and March Motivation Madness 17. We are absolutely killing the game when it comes to March Motivation Madness. Getting a lot of downloads, a lot of likes on the posts. It really, really um, puts it in perspective of how many people are actually listening and how many people are actually enjoying the content. So if you are, big thumbs up. Thank you for listening. Make sure you leave a review on iTunes. And if you want to support the show, there's some merchandise for sale now as well. There will be a link in the show notes. Uh, There's an exclusive five-day offer, that limited edition run called Run Fit Pro Pod that you can pick up today for a, a very, very affordable price as well as just shows that you are supporting the show that you enjoy and other people can see what you enjoy and it'll get the word out there a lot more as well. Now, that being said, that was the intro. Let's get into the episode. Let me pull up my Evernote. As you all know, I use Evernote on everything, guys. Uh, there's no affiliate link for Evernote, so I'll just use it and uh, tell you about it. It's, it really makes my life easy across all my platforms. I just use one program and it syncs every time. It's great. Now, today's quote is 80% of success is showing up. Woody Allen. 80 percent of success is showing up by Woody Allen now we've got to take this with a grain of salt guys because I don't know if you remember if you're old young enough to know but Woody Allen actually married his adopted daughter so uh Yoko Ono so take it with a grain of salt but there's very there's a lot of wisdom in the words that 80 percent of success is showing up people Usually, usually, I mean, it's one of the hardest steps, but also one of the easiest steps. Make, take action towards creating something in their life, whether that be a relationship, a business, or themselves. They always take in, they take the action. It's the follow through. It's the follow up that never, that that sinks more ships than it, it, it makes sail. So, 80% of success is showing up. Most people start but never finish. Uh, Because there is never a finish line. But most people stop and never get going. Um, There's two excuses that I hear all the time. And let's run through those. I have no time. Saying you don't have time to put in work is ridiculous. Especially after you've seen success. It's like winning the lotto and saying, oh, I don't have time to cash it in. It's ridiculous. You have time. You just, your priorities are wrong. Your priorities aren't where they need to be. Because if you really wanted to be successful, you would be doing it right now. You'd be taking the steps to do it right now. And you need to take a big long look at yourself in the mirror and go, am I doing enough to be able to uh, talk how I'm talking? Or build the business that I dream of? Or build the body or have the relationship that I dream of? No time. That's ridiculous. Everybody's got time. You can make time. Wake up earlier. Go to bed later. Whatever it means to you, it's got to mean something. Um, you have t- we have too much on our plates. Is the second excuse I always hear. Having too many things on your plate may at first seem to be exact same condition as being too lazy, but it really isn't. How often do we find ourselves with hundreds of tasks that would take only moments to complete? But we become so overwhelmed that we don't get them done. Tasks just get pushed back, and other things take their place. This isn't a case. Of be- this this isn't a case of being too lazy. It's being too disorganized. This can be easily fixed by either basically creating, delegating um, effectively, getting a highly organized assistant, or as I call a whiteboard and my uh, diary, and. That, that will nag you into getting things done and or training and discipline 
but whatever you do, it has to get done. Training and discipline are the most important things. You don't become a world champion mixed martial artist. You don't become a world bending entrepreneur. You don't create a chiseled physique. You don't create a long lasting relationship without training and discipline. If you don't learn, you will die. If you don't, if you aren't disciplined, you will never achieve your goals. Training and discipline. That being said, that was 80% of success is showing up and what I think that means. If you agree with me, make sure you like us on Twitter at FitPro Podcast. Check out all of the episodes that I've put out over the, the last few months. Episode 90, 90, 90, 90. Let me have a look because there's been a few now. Bear with me. Uh, maybe while you're listening to this, go and check out those shirts. <laughs> Um, let me have a look and I plan to do a walkthrough on how to create merchandise as well at some point Um, I'm really enjoying it I'm really enjoying the process I'm really enjoying learning now what I do when I don't know how to do something is I study it I look it up all the information that people are paying for is out there for free I don't know if you've heard about it but there's this little site called Google Google is amazing for entrepreneurs it's amazing for people that want to grow we're up to episode 93 by the way uh, pe- people that want to grow people that want to move and move their mind and exercise their mind you can't get better than Google guys the information's out there the core things that people are paying thousands and thousands of thousands of dollars for all it is is a collage or a uh, I forget the word, but they're taking all the information that is free, putting it in a convenient package so that you can have it. It's like protein shake. People are selling you protein shakes when you can just eat eggs. That is, (laughs) quote me on that one. That would be, I'm going to keep that quote. Thanks for listening to the podcast, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.